kadai i prepare any type of dry vegetables alu fry this kadai little less oil from steel kadai if i fry fish do the steel kadai is thick bottom but need some more oil than iron kadai it is my own experience so i prepare fish curry bengali fish curry in this iron kadai and after cooking then and there i poured this fish curry in another vessel for prevention of any metallic smell and black color in this fish curry it is also very convenient for me iron kadai increase iron that is hemoglobin in our body maximum ladies in india i think suffer from anemia so i recommend iron vessel it is 10.5 that is 10.5 inch i buy it from local market now my another iron vessel it is a cast iron vessel and its size is little less than 10 inch you can see i hope you can see little less than 10 inch but it is also very convenient for me in this pan that is cast iron pan it takes less than oil than this iron sheet kadai it is a pure iron sheet kadai and it is cast iron pan i want to buy a kadai of this cast iron but now it is not available in my home i prepare grill fish in this cast iron pan and prepare any type of curry that is i also prepare alu dum bengali alu dum bengali kumro chakka in this and the result is very good very very good and if i grill fish preparation then fish also not stuck in the bottom because it is a very thick bottom and very much heavy it is a iron sheet kadai that is pure iron kadai it is made from iron sheets carved and prepared this kadai shape and it is a cast iron that means in high temperature iron may melt and mixed with other material that is silica carbon so it is breakable if it drop out then it can be break but this kadai is not breakable but cleaning in this kadai is take some effort but this pan 
that is cast iron pan take less effort than this iron kadai and oil initially it take some oil but gradually it take less oil though it is quite heavy i hope you can understand main difference between cast iron and iron it is manufacturing i told you that is it is prepared from iron sheet so it is thin you can see it is thin and it is thick because it, at first iron melt in high temperature and then mix with other material that is silica and carbon percentage is very low but mix with melted iron and then this melted iron poured in a cast and then it is produced i also use lid this lid is also cover this kadai and this cast iron pan also but cast iron pan and iron kadai that is pure iron and cast iron gives some natural iron in our food so it is beneficial for anemic patient cast iron cooker initially take oil but gradually that is after a certain period of time it takes less oil you can say minimum oil or oil free so i buy some more cast iron because i love it very much than pure iron so i also buy this skillet i buy it from raktawa brand and it is i hope you can so can also see little less than 8 inch sorry 8.5 that is 8.5 inch little less than or more than 8 inch when i prepare single serving this time i use this pan and i prepare this cast iron pan for egg preparation that is egg roll or omelet or poached egg any type of egg preparation except boiled egg i use it it is also little less than 8 inch and more than 7.5 inch not more than it is exact 7.5 i hope you also can see i also have a cast iron paniyaram pan i prepare many recipe in this paniyaram not only paniyaram i also prepare litti in this pan and kochuri kadai shutir kochuri bengali recipe and any type of kochuri i prepare in this for oil free version because it is a cast iron so i use it and it has 12 cavity so at a time 12 paniyaram litti or kochuri can prepared though it is too much heavy i buy this 10 inch cast iron skillet and this paniyaram pan and some more things from sikandar store madurai tamil nadu and 
also i buy this tarka pen or tempering pen though not only tempering i use it i prepare egg when i prepare single leg this time i use this pen and it is 4.5 inch and it has wooden handle so grip is also very convenient though cast iron utensil have no wooden or any type of this time grip is also difficult though this cast iron egg pen is has silicon cover so in this case grip is also convenient and it is dosha tawa you can see it is 10 inch i also it is very heavy so i can't lift it <laughs> anyway you can see how much it is thick it is also cast iron and i buy it from rock tower brand i share also its unboxing and review video earlier in my channel you can also watch this video for detailed information about this dosa tawa and you can see a rust because i am not covered it not polish it after washing this tawa because it is a roti or paratha tawa i prepare paratha <coughs> without oil that is dry paratha so i am not use oil in this tawa and so rust is form i purchase this roti tawa locally it is 10 inch or you can say little less than 10 inch it has wooden handle so when i prepare roti or paratha convenient for grip i easily lift out this tawa but in this case that is dosa tawa when i prepare dosa i cannot easily move for moving this tawa i need some gloves or any type of cotton for gripping this portion this handle portion because it is also iron made but i am very much happy but result is very much good that is dosa come out very nice you can see details video of this cast iron dosa tawa and nowadays i use it earlier i use this tawa it is a hawkins futura tawa and it has a handle when i prepare dosa in this tawa this time this handle is not hot in this portion it is hot and here little cut 
I hope you can see. Before cut portion is not hot. So, I can easily grip it. But it is a hard anodized tawa. That means aluminium tawa covered with hard anodized and I change it with now this cast iron tawa. Result is also very good that is dosha is come out very nicely in this tawa that is Hawkins Futura tawa.